Space is a truly mysterious place, but at the same time it is filled with some serious threats and dangers. Extreme temperatures, deadly radiation, and an aggressive environment. But even against this generally unfriendly background, there are particularly dangerous and frightening places that stand out especially. The universe has prepared many more bizarre worlds for us. How can one planet be hotter than the sun, and the other is bigger than its star? We have prepared for you a list of the most mind-blowing worlds. Let's take a look at the scariest of them. Welcome to the Space Stop channel. And in this video, I will tell you about the strangest and most mysterious planets known to space. Before you start watching the video, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel as a sign of gratitude for our efforts. I wish you a pleasant viewing. J1407b is one of the strangest planets discovered by scientists, located about 434 light years from Earth. This is Saturn on steroids. Studying this eerie world, astronomers have struggled to accurately measure its mass, but it is believed that it is about 40 Jupiter masses. J1407b is also a giant planet, much larger than the largest planet in our solar system. What shocked scientists was the ring system of the planet of enormous size. It consists of 30 rings, each of which has tens of millions of kilometers in diameter. According to rough estimates, the diameter of the entire ring system is 120 million kilometers or 75 million miles. That's 200 times more than the rings around Saturn. If Saturn had such a large ring system, it would be visible in our night sky. Although it would be a spectacular view, it wouldn't last long. The rings would eventually become thinner, as several satellites would form around the planet. Another exoplanet located 57 light years from Earth. The planet, dubbed GJ504b, is four times more massive than Jupiter, but has about the same size. The strangest thing about this planet is that it is pink, a rather unusual color for a planet. So how did it get its color? It is believed that the age of this system is about 160 million years, which is an extremely small age compared to our solar system. For example, our solar system originated more than four and a half billion years ago, and because of the young age of the exoplanet, it is still changing and losing the heat of its formation, which gives it a dim purple glow. But our universe is represented not only by bright colors, it also has many planets rich in water. An exoplanet like Neptune, an aquatic world called GJ1214b, has a mass of more than eight terrestrial and a radius about one and a half times the radius of Jupiter. And although this alien world may seem promising because of its abundance of water, it is not a double of Earth. The planet has no solid surface, and its atmosphere is strikingly different from what we have. Due to the extreme pressure and high temperature, it consists of water in a strange form of plasma that behaves differently than that found on Earth. Despite the fact that the temperature there reaches 280 degrees Celsius, the water in GJ1214b is rather in a constant supercritical liquid form. Thus, it has some properties of both a liquid and a gas, but, in general, it is neither one or the other at the same time. Now, let's move on to the constellation Cygnus. There, about 650 light years from us, is a red-hot world Kepler-70b with a mass of only half the Earth's and a radius almost twice the radius of our planet. It is one of the hottest exoplanets known to us. The planet star Kepler-70 was once a main sequence star similar to our Sun, while Kepler-70b used to be a gas giant the size of Jupiter. But about 18 million years ago, the star passed the red giant stage. As a result of the fact that the planet spent a significant amount of time inside its now-dead star, only a red-hot iron car remained of it. Scientists believe the planet is still evaporating, which could eventually make it even smaller. So, how hot is it here? Because Kepler-70b is 65 times closer to its star than Mercury is to the Sun, the temperature on this exoplanet reaches a staggering 7,000 degrees Celsius. For comparison, 
The surface temperature of our sun is only about five and a half thousand degrees Celsius. So if hell exists, then it must be him. About 640 light years away is another scorching exoplanet, dubbed WASP 76b. The planet is known for having a permanent dark side and rains of molten iron. The object, discovered in the year 2016, is almost as massive as Jupiter. Since it is completely attached to the star, the planet pretends all the time. The temperature on the daytime side reaches 2,400 degrees Celsius. This is more than enough to cause the evaporating of metals such as iron into the atmosphere. In addition, the radiation that the day garden receives is thousands of times more than our planet receives from the sun. The dark side of WASP-76 is almost twice as cold. Because of this extreme temperature difference, strong winds form on this exoplanet. Because of this, iron vapors from another part of the planet are carried by the wind to the north side, and when this steam cools down, molten iron pours out of it. This is strange enough, but not as strange as a planet called PSRJ 17191438b, but what's so impressive about it? This exoplanet is 3,000 times larger than its neutron host star. Moreover, it wasn't always a planet, in the past it was a star. But let's start from the beginning. The exoplanet orbits an incredibly dense and tiny neutron star with a diameter of about 20 kilometers. Just one teaspoon of the substance of this star on Earth would weigh billions of tons. The star is also a millisecond pulsar that emits beams of radiation rotating every 5 milliseconds. That's about 10,000 revolutions per minute. At the same time, this alien exoplanet is more massive than Jupiter. So why is it so small and at the same time so massive? This is because the exoplanet was once a star whose outer layers were ripped off by a much more massive nearby pulsar. As a result, a carbon residue remained from the star, which turned into a diamond world, about five times the size of our planet. Now its diameter is about 60,000 kilometers. Space seemed to be overflowing with strange exoplanets, and some of them have such bizarre properties that it is difficult to believe in the existence of these celestial bodies. Dubbed WASP-107b, this peculiar world has the density of cotton candy, which forces scientists to reconsider their ideas about how gas giants are formed. Although the exoplanet is about the same size as Jupiter, its mass is only 30 Earth masses, but Jupiter is 300 times more massive than our home planet. Moreover, the core of WASP-107b is only four times larger than the core of the Earth, while it should be about 10 times larger than the core of our planet. Because of all this, WASP-107b has an incredibly low density. In fact, it's like a marshmallow floating in space. So far, none of these worlds seem to give us any hope of colonizing them. The vastness of space is unimaginable. J2126 is living proof of this. This strange world was once considered a free-floating or lonely planet. But this celestial body is not so lonely. It turns out that J2126 is moving in space together with its native star. The strangest thing is that both objects have been known to astronomers for many years, but no one has seen a connection between them. But then scientists discovered that the exoplanet and the star are about 104 light years from the sun, which means that they are connected. Later observations showed that the planet orbits its star at a distance of a trillion kilometers. This is about 7,000 times the distance from our planet to the Sun. This makes it the largest orbital radius of all the planets known to date. Interestingly, the result of such a huge orbit is that a year on this exoplanet is about 200,000 Earth years. The last exoplanet on our list is Koi-5b and the uniqueness of this space object lies not in its advantages, but in the system of which it is a member. The planet, about half the size of Saturn, was initially ignored because of its complexity and was even considered science fiction. Ten years later, the system, dubbed Koi-5, 
was given the scientific attention it deserved. It turned out that astronomers had stumbled upon a system of three stars. The planet orbits star A, which has a relatively close companion, star B. They both revolve around each other every 30 years. But there is also a third gravitationally bound star, the C star. And this star orbits the stars A and B every 400 years. If we could somehow get to this exoplanet and hover on the edge of the atmosphere of this world with the help of our spaceship, we would see breathtaking and unusual things. The view from below would most likely be filled with dark brown and gray clouds, and instead of one sun, you would see two. One 17 times larger than our star, and the other completely smaller and only slightly brighter than our sun. But despite this, a fainter star will still glow a thousand times brighter than the full moon here on Earth. No matter how unusual these alien planets may be, there may be even stranger celestial bodies in our universe. So far, the forms are purely hypothetical, but some scientists believe that they may actually exist. If this is the case, then such mysterious worlds would be formed as a result of collisions of gas and dust particles surrounding black holes. These planets would also evolve at great distances from supermassive black holes, which would cause their orbits to stretch for millions of years. The universe has no boundaries not only in terms of distances, but also in terms of creativity. From time to time, Astronomers discover mind-blowing space objects that expand our limited understanding of the place in which we live. It took us many years to discover all the planets of our solar system, and they still surprise us with their properties. So who knows how many more interesting discoveries about 5,000 known exoplanets we still have ahead of us.